subscribe to RA Solutions by clicking on the subscribe button and clicking on the bell icon to receive notifications. Hello there, welcome to another video by RA Solutions. In this video, what I'm going to be doing is showing you five new ways uh, working with Microsoft Word. Before I continue with this video, what I would like you to do is subscribe to my channel, like this video, click on a bell icon to receive notifications of any future uploads. So, five new ways to work with Microsoft Word. Number one, collaborate with anyone, anywhere. So there's no need to huddle around the same computer or send files back and forth. You can all edit the same copy of the document even in real time with the new version of Microsoft Word in the Office 365 suite. You can save to the cloud. Saving your files to the cloud lets you access them from anywhere and makes it easy to share with your team. So if you click on file at the top left hand corner, save as, you can save onto OneDrive, you can save into the cloud which could be accessed um, by any computer. Work together in real time, co-author documents in real time and see others changes as they happen. So if I'm working on a document here and somebody else has the link to this document, you can both edit the same document at the same time in real time and that's what I mean by that. You can also give or receive ideas, track your changes and share your thoughts in comments. Everyone can add to the conversation and stay on top of the changes. So if you go to review at the top, click on new comment, you can track your changes and you can leave and review. Click on the review pane, it will come down here on the left side with all the changes and all the things you need to review in terms of the comments that have been left. So number two, you listen to your content. If you're too busy to sit down and read, you can listen instead. So the way to do this is by going to the review option at the top, click on the read aloud option here if you are too um, tired to be reading the document yourself. So if I click on that, read aloud. Raw solutions. There you go. So obviously the computer would read back to you. So you can read aloud in Word, letting you hear your document and each word is highlighted as solutions. Read, read. You can change the reading speed and the voice of your narrator. So if I click on that, oh, let me try that one more time. Raw solutions. So here, click on here, you can change the reading speed on the left side and you can change the narrator so if I want somebody else to read and I can change the speed of the narrator. Raw solutions. There you have it. So read aloud is one of Word's learning tools designed to aid people with dyslexia and dyspraxia but it can also help anyone working on their reading skills. Really, really useful especially if you've got uh, children in in infant in junior school helping them with their reading skills by using the read aloud function will really really help their own reading and understanding number three translate break the language barrier read a document in your own language or translate it to your reader's language without leaving microsoft word now you can use the translator to look up and learn what words and phrases mean in other languages and you can translate selected text or full documents across 60 languages. You can get more information if you go to review at the top here, um, go to the translate option here. Now if I type in RA solutions, I deleted it or something, let's say hello this time instead. If I can spell correctly, go to translate. You can translate the selection or translate the whole document let's translate the whole document there and then what you can do you can select the text uh, and it will detect what you've um, selected here so this is my language I'm um, translating from which is English and I'm going to translate to and I'm going to choose my language here as to the language I will be translating to here so I can translate into French for example and it will translate hello to French there and that's a really cool way and if you like the translation you can insert that into your text there so if you want to translate it back so um, you can choose the English again and you can choose that word and it will translate it back but also obviously it will keep the original 
the other one which you translated earlier there so check out that feature translate you can choose your languages here you can set your proofing language here and you can change your language preferences here so you can set your proofing languages by clicking on there and it will check ask you which proofing language you want to check your work in I will always choose English United Kingdom click on OK and then you can in the language part here click on the language preferences to change the preferences of the language you selected there so let me cancel out of that so one more time go to review at the top go to translate and you can translate your document you can also change your translator preferences here as well so you click on that and obviously here it will bring here on the right side the um, translator pane here you can change the settings here um, and you can play around with this as well there. so that's a really cool feature to translate English into various other languages and vice versa number four dictate so typing can take a lot of time writing emails drafting documents why not type with your voice and be hands-free um, type edit and format documents by speaking in word anything you say turns into text now just out of interest just um, for your information dictate is an add-in word um, add-in for Microsoft Word Outlook and PowerPoint it adds a dictation tab to the top ribbon you can find out more information how the add-in works for dictate by going to aka.mrms forward slash dictate so let's show you how this dictate works here so if I'm too tired to write um, what you can do is use the dictate function go to the top um, um, ribbon go to the home tab scroll across to the right side and there's a dictate option there and all you simply do is click on the dictate button here hello this is RA solutions um, five new ways to work in Microsoft Word full stop there you have it so that's a simple sentence I've just um, dictated to Microsoft Word hello this is RA solutions five new ways to work in Microsoft Word full stop and there you have it so that's really quick and really easy um, check out the dictate function in Microsoft Word let's click on the arrow and you can choose your different languages um, you want to preview in or your preferences again so check out that as well at the same time so number five proofread as you type feel more confident writing in word editor has your back now editor checks your spelling and grammar and also offers style suggestions to help you improve your writing now the way we can access editor is by going to the review tab at the top in the top ribbon scrolling to the left side there is an editor option here um, you click on that or click on F7 on your keyboard and as you are typing it will give you suggestions so obviously in terms of your spelling grammar um, in terms of your refinements you can make here so obviously these are the French words for spelling and grammar I weren't going to spell them out to you um, just in case I made a mistake and obviously you can it will give you some refinements here to make as well and you can click on the settings and obviously change the settings as what your preference is so those are five new ways to work in Microsoft Word for more information on these five new ways check out aka.ms forward slash editor in Word I will put the link in the description in the video um, before I leave you before you leave me please subscribe to this channel please like this video give this video a thumbs up um, click on that bell notification um, bell icon to receive notifications of future uploads please comment in the comment section if there is any more or if there's any other videos you would like me to create or if there's anything you're stuck with any help you need I'll be more than happy to help out where I can please like subscribe and share